Hey everyone, welcome back to Wixfix. I hope you're having a fantastic day. My name is Ryan and in today's video, we're gonna be checking out hover interactions inside of Wix Studio. Let's go ahead and get started. So here we are in Wix Studio and what we're gonna to wanna to do is apply some sort of hover interaction to elements on our website. So in order to do this, we can select an element we can come over to the inspector panel and head on over to the interactions tab. Down here, you can see the hover interactions and we can press add. Now here we'll see a bunch of different presets that we can choose from like grow, shrink, skew, rotate, move, twist, fade, and appear. Now, if you don't wanna use these presets, you can easily switch over to custom and create your own custom animation. For this example, what I'm gonna choose is animation one. And if I go into edit, you'll be able to see all of the changes that I basically made. For example, I added a green border, nine pixel width. I made the corners more rounded. I added a shadow. On top of that, I rotated the image, scaled it up, and added a little bit of skew and translation. So if I go ahead and preview the website, anytime I hover over this image, you will kind of see it change to the hover state. Now, as of right now, it's not doing a smooth transition. Hopefully this is something that gets changed over time because personally, I'm not a huge fan of the snapping to the effect. I like how Editor X kind of made it a more smoother transition. Um, so I'm sure that is something that they are working on because right now it's just kind of snapping and it doesn't look the best. But this effect is very useful, let's say if you link text. So if I linked this text to, let's say the about page, and let's just go ahead and remove the underline real quick. Then what we could do to simulate a button or a click is come over to interactions, hover, add, and for text elements, we actually have a color preset. So if we go ahead and click on this and go into adjust, we can change the fill color to something like that. And now when we preview the website, when we hover over this text right here, it basically simulates to the user that we can actually click on this, similar to a button. Now, once again, it, right now, it seems like it is snapping, even though we have like an easy ease uh, effect applied. Um, so hopefully this is something that gets changed here pretty soon or they're looking to fix because even with this image, I don't really like how it's just snapping to the effect. I, I would want it to be a little bit more of a smooth transition. But overall, all you really need to know about hover interactions is you select the element that you want to affect, you come over to interactions, come down to hover, and you can add specific interactions to it. You can even choose from a preset and adjust that preset to your exact needs, or you can just create a custom one from scratch. But that's basically gonna wrap it up for today's video. If you all did enjoy, please consider giving this video a like and subscribing to the channel for more Wix Studio content coming out really soon. Thank you all again, and I'll see you on the next one.